So we're looking at the life cycle of a mushroom in the phylum Basidia mycota. These are haploid Basidia spores, which means they only have half of the organism's DNA. Once a suitable environment is found, they will germinate into short-lived haploid mycelium. You can see the hyphae growing here. Once the two hyphae of opposite mating types join, they form a complete genome. So now this dikaryotic mycelium is genetically distinct from its parents. When the food supply is depleted and the conditions are right, a fruiting body is formed. The gills of a mushroom are lined with spore-bearing structures called basidium. At this point, the two nuclei fuse and undergo meiosis to form four haploid nuclei. Two of each mating type will migrate up into the tips of the basidium. Here they will swell and be dispersed to start the whole process over again. Thank you for watching. I hope this video helped you understand the life cycle of a mushroom.